cure it. But what happens when the cancer spreads to the liver? Surgical oncologist Dr. Charles Cha with the Cancer Institute at Hartford Healthcare St. Vincent's Medical Center is here to explain. Doctor, welcome. Thank you for having me. Great to have you. So recently there have been a number of high profile cases of patients who've lost their battle with colon cancer. Does the cancer typically <laughs> spread if it's not diagnosed early? Well, fortunately, colon cancer is very curable when it's caught early and even potentially pre preventable when caught in the polyp stage. And that's why we encourage everybody to get screened at age 45. However, despite that, around one in two patients who develop colon cancer will have liver metastasis or spread to liver during the course of their disease. And doctor, let's talk about when it spreads to the liver. What is the prognosis? Well, the good news is that unlike other types of cancers, when colon cancer patients develop liver metastases, if we can remove all the liver disease, they're still potentially curable. That's something that not all patients and for that matter, providers really are aware of, and that's part of the reason why I want to speak about it today. Doctor, can you talk about some of the advancements, both surgically and technique-wise, that you now are able to treat your patients with? Sure. There have been a lot of recent advancements, particularly in surgical technique, using minimally invasive techniques, laparoscopic techniques, as well as improvements in chemotherapy. Um, Part of the reason why we're able to do what we do is that the liver is a remarkable organ. I can remove up to 80% of the liver using several different techniques, uh, and it'll grow back and function normally. Uh, so what I tell patients is that if we can remove all their liver disease, their long-term outcome becomes the same as if this, the cancer had never spread to their liver, which is something that's different than other types of cancers. All right, who is most at risk for colon cancer liver metastasis? So all patients with a history of colon cancer are at risk. Uh, sometimes the metastases are evident or occur at initial presentation, which happens about 25% of the time. Uh, sometimes they develop later during the course of the disease, but overall around half of all colon cancer patients will develop liver metastases. All right, and uh, final question, what are the treatment options? So, as I mentioned before, really complete surgical removal is really the one best way to give patients the greatest chance for cure when colorectal cancer spreads to the liver, uh, which can often be done, as I mentioned earlier, laparoscopically or using uh, keyhole minimally invasive techniques. We can do that even in patients with relatively large tumors uh, and uh, remove large portions of the liver laparoscopically. Uh, what is a surprise sometimes to patients and providers is that the number and the size of tumors is not really a barrier for whether we can remove these tumors completely. And really, patients ought to be seen by an experienced liver surgeon to decide. I can sometimes remove part of the liver, allow the other side to grow back, and then go back and remove more. When we can't completely remove tumors, we can use microwave ablation, uh, chemotherapy, radioactive uh, beads, which can be injected into tumors to try to help keep disease at bay. But really, the main message to patients is that uh, in patients with liver metastases, that there's a lot of hope, particularly if we can remove all the disease surgically. All right, Dr. Charles Cha with Hartford Healthcare St. Vincent's Medical Center, thank you very much. Thanks for having me.